Hi, this is Mercedes again, and I'm here to show you one of uh, my pink cushions that I just made. Actually, I made a few, and um, I'm so happy the way they look that I want to share with you. And this is my pink cushion. Isn't it this beautiful? I am so addictive to make these pink cushions. Everything that I can find around the house, I turn it in a pink cushion. And they are so easy and fun to make that I cannot stop making them. Um, and the, the pins, I mean, I love it too. I love to make them. And you see how easy and so beautiful. Look at the beautiful, beautiful um, flower that I use in this one. And this, oh my God, I had so much fun creating this charm. Ah, oh, this is a big, chunky charm thing. And now I cannot take it from here. So, no, we want hand. So, let's see it from here. Look at this. I did a using um, a cork. I bought a bag of corks in uh, Michael, and it come. I think it's two different sizes. And um, what I did with the cork first, well, I did not paint it on anything because I kind of like it like that. Um, <clears throat> I glue some uh, lace ribbon tool I put flowers in I make a bowl and I stick it all in there and in the top you see what I used to create the loop this is one of the Tim Holtz pin and I just insert it there um, sometimes I put a tiny uh, a tiny glossy accent just to keep it in there you know but this one I don't think I put anything. If I want ever to change it or take it out, I can still be using the be, be able to use the pink. So that's the one reason why I did it that way. But look at this. Then in the bottle of the cork, I put another pin of tin holes to make this other loop and hang this big um oh how to call this. You know. You know what it is better than me. <laughs> Sorry about that I can't. And then I put more tool ribbon and another flower and I start hanging all my charms and beads and oh my god, all kind of stuff, you know. I use what I do. I do 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 have a here, hold on. I got this roll of of chain long time ago. Well, it's not that long, but I mean, look, I have used it a lot. Plus, I share with my friends too. Or when I have any classes, so. And I grab one of that chain, and here is it. See, we have so much. It's kind of hard, but let me try to see. I put the shoe and I put a, a regular key that I'm it's not worth it, doesn't work now. I think I changed the lock or something, and I always keep the the keys for, for craft or anything. So I put that one in there. I use all kind of bits, and look at this. Ah. Isn't it this beautiful the way it shine and oh my god it look like 3D and everything. See I put a heart, B, a B caps, and um here um one of this one that is beautiful. And this one, look at how I did this one. This is a birdie. And I put it in the top with the B, the B cap, and I hang um more base in here. I love this one. Look at this one. It's so big. And it's just beautiful. Some B caps. The big B. And there you go. Look at this one. I love it. This is a necklace 
that I bought in a, um, I think it was a thrift store. I broke it and used it in different pieces. Pieces. Look at this one. This is from the Midian Smith thing. So is this. If I can. It's kind of. I'm sorry. This. This is. I don't know. This is with this. But it's all mess in there. I put butterfly. I cleared a butterfly. It's, um, I got this one. I think it was for from Tommy and my swap with her. And look at this angel and some winds on her with winds. And Tommy, give me this. I love it. Um, I I didn't know what it was supposed to be in the back, but it was plain. So I add this beautiful charm that I got from Ree. Thank you, Ree, and thank you, Tommy. I love it. So beautiful, everything. Look at this. It's a big one. I mean, it is so fun doing this charm, you know. And and it's long. Look at this. I just hang hang it. I'm sorry. In my cup but obviously it's not to stay over there because it's too 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 long but I love it and let me this is the first one no actually this is the last one that I made the other night and I made this other one look at how full of this look at these pins look I mean you can create a pin with anything anything that you find around and that I have a hole you can make it I even put this uh, angels that I make I made a mold with the Prima angels I think it's Prima if I'm not mistaken and what I do is that this I use the clay and this is um, Crayola clay I was using uh, Martha Stewart clay but to tell you the truth, it's kind of expensive. So, oh my God, I'm not focused. The light is too, too much. It's not focusing in the face. There you go. Better. Okay. There you go. So, look at this one. A flower, a leaf, beads. I just love it. I love to create it. Look at this one. So I have a big big one look but I like it I mean I think it it's just so fun to do I grab all my things and put it in a, in a basket and go to the living room and while I'm watching TV or doing something that I've been sitting for a while then I start making them I got this butterfly from my friend Tommy Thank you, Tommy. See? And this, um, these beads, I got this from, oh my God, I was fan of YouTube channel, the other that I think is uh, North Starter. If, if I'm not saying it right, I'm so sorry. But I got the idea from her. Uh, she go to Dollar Bead. Let me tell you. This store have the bid for so good price. I mean, there was a dollar, cent, you name it. And I went there, of course, the other day. And I bought me a bunch of those bids. I mean, they were a very great price. I could not pass them out. And if you can see, they are very good, you know. For the price, you're getting a good, good selection, and they are good, I mean, and they have all kinds of stuff, so, of course, I had to go, and the thing is, look at this, this is neat, this is like a, a postcard letter or something like that, and it's a metal, and I place an order, and believe it or not, Three days after I have my products. Look at this. Isn't this nice? 
beautiful. You say, I love you. It's a postcard and it's a charm. Well, you use it for anything. Look at this. It's nice. It is beautiful. And they have all kind of. Look at these ones. I mean, it's not just one thing. They have everything. Swarovski crystals. Um, I cannot keep telling how good they are. You know, they are a very good quality. The chipping is amazing fast and I love it thank you so much Tara and um, I'll be going back then I place an order in another store she referred to where she buy this beautiful big cat so that's coming up next but anyway let me finish what I was trying to show you here the second teacup. This is my other charm. Actually, this is the first charm I made with the cork. Ah, oh, it's so hot. I'm so sorry. With just one hand, I don't think I can. But anyway, let's look it up from here. This is the big cork, if you can see it. And I put a beautiful lace on it. And I put this beautiful, beautiful beads hanging. Um, I put these branches with these beads. I use my wall orchid flowers that I love so much. And a bunch of things. This one have a little bit less than the other one that I show you here. But it's the same concept, you know. Again, butterfly that Tommy gave me, which I love. Cylinders, beads, bee caps. I mean, you can put anything you want. And um, I put a sewing machine. I got this beautiful key chain that um, Tommy gave me in our swap. I love it. And a cameo. More beads, cylinders. I mean, it's beautiful. I use tool, and I love it. It's a nice, nice chunk of chain. So I'm happy with that. And that was my project for the date. Oh no, I got one more thing that I have to show you. And I think I got the idea from Nurse Tara too. She was showing how to do this beautiful arrangement with um, with your beads and your big cups and look they look like angels now and like a dress or if you put it this way like a flower I don't know I thought that it was so great and beautiful look at this one she was saying to do it with the paper flowers and I said well let me she said she challenged us to use our imagination and use whatever we have at hand. So I said, let me use my um, a clear of flowers, and I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I like it. This is a long bee cap, but I have another one here. Look at this one. Isn't this beautiful? Is amazing. Let me see if I can. I'm sorry. Okay, it's not gonna get much better, but it's beautiful. I got the B, the roundel, Swarovski roundel to give you that special shiny, and the B cap and the flower. I love it. I make this. It was yesterday. It was like one o'clock in the morning, and here I was watching Tara's video and making my own. The beads and dangles and I cannot stop you know the only bad thing about you know this idea is that when you start you cannot stop you know look at this one it really look like an angel <laughs> I don't know that that's what I think I may want him 
Look at this one with a nice. She was saying just to put um, glossy accent or stickles so that the flower gets hotter and it will not get messed up when dangling. And I probably do it too. I just didn't get to do it yesterday night. Well, actually, it was this morning. It was like 2 o'clock in the morning, like I said. But I may go back and go ahead and put the stickles. I just couldn't wait to show you how beautiful is that. And it's so easy. And it looks good. All I have to do now is put a, um, a clap in here. A lobster clap, you know. And put it over mm -hmm. there. And being able to hang it from whatever I want. I love it. It's beautiful. I thank you so much, Tara, for your idea. Um, I'll be creating much, much more things and looking for what I have at home here that I can use and just keep doing it. I give it a try, like you said, and I can stop now. So thank you so much, Nurse Tara, for your lovely tutorial and your idea and like I said try it it's beautiful and here we go one more last look to my project and I see you next time when I came back with more projects for you remember Jesus love you bye